discover the enchanting wonders of Montenegro. This captivating country, nestled in natural beauty and adorned with magical beaches along the breathtaking Adriatic Sea coast, beckons sports enthusiasts to indulge in the thrill of skiing, cycling, sailing, and diving. Every year it draws in millions of adventure seekers eager to explore its one-of-a-kind treasures. Don't miss the chance to experience the allure of Montenegro. Welcome to the Fascinating Traditions channel. Here, we unravel fascinating secrets and explore the incredible world around us. Don't miss out on the discoveries. Subscribe now, activate notifications and embark on this knowledge adventure with us. With a tumultuous history, Montenegro was home to great empires in the past. During the Soviet era, it was affiliated with Yugoslavia. In 2003, after the disintegration, it joined the new Yugoslavia with Serbia. However, only three years later, it declared independence through a referendum in 2006. Thus, Montenegro took separate paths, establishing itself as a new state. The country is home to many historical buildings, monasteries, and the stunning Tara River Canyon, as well as the city of Kotar, all under the protection of UNESCO. The ideal time to visit Montenegro is between May and September, perfect for exploring crystal-clear beaches and the Adriatic Sea. While Kotar often comes to mind when talking about Montenegro, the capital of the country, Podgorica, is frequently overlooked. One-third of the population lives in this city, which has become a business center. On the map, it borders countries like Croatia, Bosnia and Herzegovina to the north, Albania to the south, Serbia and Kosovo to the east, and the Adriatic Sea to the west. Despite its relatively small size, Kotar offers a lively and eclectic nightlife. The city's bars and clubs come to life after sunset, providing a vibrant experience for nightlife lovers. Traveling to Montenegro is accessible, especially for vacations, without the need for a visa for stays under 90 days. The climate varies from Mediterranean on the coasts to continental in the inland regions, making the country welcoming year-round. A surprising convenience for visitors is tap water in Montenegro being drinkable. Unlike some tourist destinations, here you can rely on tap water, which is convenient and saves the cost of bottled water. Montenegro has attracted foreign investors in recent years. With just 2,000 euros, it is possible to start a business in 10 days, facilitating the acquisition of residence and work permits. The government actively seeks to attract foreign entrepreneurs, resulting in over 50,000 foreign businesses established in the country, including Brazilian entrepreneurs. With the expectation of joining the European Union by 2025, Montenegro projects a significant increase in its income potential. EU membership will open doors to business opportunities in other European countries for residents, making Montenegro an attractive place to live. Living in Montenegro offers a peaceful atmosphere, away from the global hustle. With a small population and controlled traffic, the country provides a serene life. However, the limited public may pose a challenge for entrepreneurs. Despite having a conservative and religion-linked culture, Montenegro welcomes people from different backgrounds. The population is multilingual, with Montenegrin as the official language and influences from Serbian, Bosnian, Albanian, and Croatian. However, English is not widely spoken. Montenegro heavily depends on tourism and foreign investments, with an economy that imports most products. The banking sector is still developing, presenting challenges for transactions. Living costs, although lower than in many European countries, include affordable rent, electricity bills, water, and internet. With a minimum wage of 450 euros, Montenegro offers a comfortable life for those choosing to settle in this charming corner of the Balkans. With an average age of 30, Montenegro is a country with a relatively young population. Despite its rich history, the average life expectancy is 73 years for men and 78 years for women, showing an intriguing blend of tradition and modernity. Marrying a Montenegrin citizen can open doors to deeper integration. By becoming a citizen, you become part of a society that is half Balkan, half Latin, sharing not only natural beauty but also local values and traditions. 
Montenegro's food culture reflects Hungarian and Turkish influences, featuring dishes like burek and baklava. With a Mediterranean touch, the use of olive oil is common. Local markets offer a variety of cheeses, with rastan being a popular dish, mixing dark green cabbage, lamb, and homemade sausage. Despite its charm, Montenegro presents challenges. The population is conservative regarding homosexuality, requiring sensitivity from visitors. Montenegro surprises with its relaxed approach to nudism. On beaches it is common to find people sunbathing naked, a widely accepted and uninhibited practice. This freedom is an interesting contrast to the conservative attitude towards some other aspects of life. Montenegrins take pride in their moderation regarding alcohol. Although they dislike excess the local culture relaxes on the beaches. However, warm hospitality and naturist beaches reveal a unique society. Montenegrin is the predominant language, with little English spoken. Understanding Serbian, Bosnian, Albanian, or Croatian can facilitate integration. The similarity between these languages, derived from Slavic culture, highlights the rich shared historical heritage in this region. Montenegro's economy is driven by tourism and foreign investments, with little internal industrial development. External dependence emphasizes the ongoing importance of attracting investors. Although tourism is robust, economic diversification is a necessity for long-term sustainability. Montenegro, with a predominantly Orthodox Christian population, is known for its religious tolerance. Muslims and Catholics also coexist in the country, reflecting a notable religious diversity. Montenegro, with its challenges and charms, offers a unique experience to those seeking a new home or business opportunities. As the economy develops, the country preserves its rich cultural and natural heritage, making it an intriguing destination in the heart of the Balkans. Tell us what intrigued you the most about this destination. Leave your comments and join us in the next video full of curiosities. Hugs and until the next exploration.